Good morning, good morning, good morning. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your boy EJ with NBF Kennel, NBF everything, nothing but family. Very important, nothing before family. Okay, we got my girl right here. Okay, hey mama. Hey, we got my boy out here. The majestic, the face, Zeusy. Hey, Zeus Bear. Hey, Zeusy Bear. Hey, Zeus Bear. Keep her from barking. She ran in the cage of Navy, so I just closed the gate. And it's working. She started all that barking shit, he gonna get on the ass, and she won't start, she'll start barking. So, as y'all can see, she's not doing too much crazy jumping around shit. This is about as much she gonna do. They got to move. She no. no. Sit. Give it anything. Specimen of God, right there. Whenever I think of Navy, I just call him the perfect dog. Just not the prettiest. This is the prettiest. Um, for anybody that's inquiring about puppies from Roxy and Zeusy, listen, man, I don't know if she took, I don't think she took, or if she did, you guys will know on Halloween. That's my deadline date. But they are dropped. All of them are dropping. So they're getting bigger by the day, but that could be because she's getting older. So I don't wanna let that be a determining factor if she's pregnant or not, because she is growing. So is he, so is she. All these dogs are just a year and a half. So. I hope she took, if she didn't, we'll, figure, we'll do it better next time. This is my first time ever having to do this, so it's definitely a learning curve. Um, so if I miss the two heats, it'll be fine. We're back there in February, so we're gonna have a crazy spring litter. Crazy April litter, crazy. So I'm not even tripping, man. Everything happens for a reason. And everything happens in God's timing. Can't rush everything. Just when, just because you think you're ready don't mean uh, God is ready for you to have it. So I definitely learned that patience is everything. With everything I do in life, only we put God first and just keep doing what we need to do every day. He and the world and the universe will work itself out. I mean, whatever happens, it's gonna, it's fine. Them not being pregnant is fine. Something else is in store. The timing isn't right. We're good. Nothing is bad. Nothing is bad about them not being pregnant. Everything's good. I'm, I'm still keeping all my girls. I'm not selling none of my dogs. Nothing like that. Um, yeah, man, we're still living the dream, man. I wake up every day. 
I get to do something I love, and it gets me out the house. It gets me fit. Like, I look fucking good, man. I wouldn't look this good if I didn't have these dogs. So, as always, a plus. Um, yeah, man, life is great. And these are my beautiful dogs, y'all. I get to wake up and play with these dogs every day. So, puppies or not, my life is pretty, it's pretty amazing. Hey, mama. Hey. You gotta learn how to chill. Okay? You must learn that. So I've been spraying the kennels and all that with the water hose, and it's, it's dumping so much water. So what I did is, I ordered a, um, I ordered a electric pressure washer. Yeah, I ordered a pressure washer. That should, that should save tons and tons of water. So that's what I'm doing right now. Saving water. When I ordered that, that should be in today or tomorrow. That will clean up everything so a lot faster, more efficient, and it won't leave a ton of water. As you know, pressure washers, it takes, it makes the smallest holes, and that pushes the pressure out. So even though it's spraying a lot of water, it's spraying it really hard, but it's not a lot coming out. So that's going to save water, and it's going to clean my kennels a lot better. And that's, that is what we're aiming for. Um... Starting this thing up, I took three years. I had Nate for three years. I didn't go buy another dog because I wanted to be sure that this is what I wanted to do. Secondly, and I wanted to be um, kind of a little seasoned. What I mean by that is I want to kind of have a little bit more information on the ownership of a dog. Not necessarily just breeding, but just learning how to be a good dog owner. And all that comes with so much patience. Like, a lot of you guys are new to the YouTube shit. And a lot of stuff that y'all don't know that I have never posted, but I've been through a lot of shit, you know? I've been through a lot of shit with Navy. I've been through a ton of shit. I've had to move places. I've had to um, pay fees. I've had Navy took to the pound. I've had to pay that fees. I have to, you guys do not know everything I've been through. I Navy has ran away plenty of times where I had to figure it out. I've called Navy at, middle elementary schools where the principals and all that has locked navy in a gate i had to go to the school and talk to the people about getting them letting me get them back without the police getting involved so much has happened to be in a position i am now and so when i reflect and i look at this i be like fuck dude you're grateful like be grateful be happy look at this y'all look at what i've done and i've never sold a dog this is just off hard work and the love of the animals. Like I'm, I'm doing this out of love, and I know love is gonna return, whether it's financially or just, just learning. Like if somebody get into this game and I'm able to teach them something by them watching my videos, look, I was a blessing to you. You know what I'm saying? So we're gonna keep moving forward like that. Nothing before family, nothing but family. And we're signing out. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. If you like my videos, I really do appreciate it. Make sure you share with a friend if they're interested in um, shit, everything bully, man. NBA.